Okay, so welcome to the second and final part of uh, Bleachers and Doom Bitch Appreciation Week because they uh, bought me something awesome from Amazon. Feel free to buy me some... Uh, no, 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 let me talk. <laughs> Feel free to buy me something awesome from Amazon. There's a link. You're welcome to do so. Uh, but for now, let's review this. Uh, there may have been one more thing in the box I haven't reviewed, but I haven't reviewed any of those figures, so we'll, we'll, we'll see how we go. And uh, we're going to review this one. And... This one. These are upscaled. Uh, hang on, I transformed that wrong. Uh, upscaled uh, beast hunters. I think it was uh, deluxe. Well, there are deluxe figures of Legends class figures. If that makes sense to anyone at home, they were this kind of size, and now they are deluxes. So. A substantial upscale and they've changed little bits but not as much as you'd think and some things they've changed for the worse and some things they've changed for the better but because they're smaller figures that are now bigger with proper quality plastic from you know the good old days they are absolutely bricks and i love them so i've had ko versions of both of these in this scale from certoys uh, and I don't mean to say anything against it. I mean, it, it's kind of dead now anyway, but I don't want to be rude, but these are better. Just the, the quality is just better, way better. I believe I gave my one of these to uh, Phoenix. And I think I've still got the other one that, that downstairs I should have brought it up. But let's have a look at them individually. So this would be um, Twin Strike, I think they call it, something like that. What was it in the original? Sinner Twin? Something like that. So you can't call it the mm, 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 stupid Americans and their moralities. Uh, but no, it's nice. Um, the colours are a lot vibrant. Uh, the necks, which become the arms, still there's no like hinge in the middle or anything like that, which is sad. Uh, I'm not sure if these came with guns originally, but uh, these don't. So, you know, what, what are you going to do? I got them from uh, the Dark Lord, so I'm not going to complain. Uh, I do think they're really cool. Like uh, little things like this would have just been on like a pressure hinge or something. Now it's got a pin. Um, these would have been ball joints. Now the uh, universal joints. Uh, these ball joints, but then they've got this, which I don't know if it's supposed to be a hinge because it doesn't really work that well as a hinge. You know, little things, but they've just changed. Like these should be a ball joint, but the universal joints. You know, little weird things like that. But they work, and they're cool, and I'm not going to complain. And just look at it. It's a big two-headed duck. What's not to love? And Windstrike. Oh, that's dusty. Oh, poor little sausage. It's a big, scary bird thing with a pointy face and clawed feet. Ah, going to get you. What's not to love? One thing I'll say against this, sadly, uh, compared to the original, is the original, there was just a ball joint here, so it went to the arm, to a ball joint. So you could fold these down. Yeah, you, know, you could fold these nice degree down to be a bit more normal, a bit more uh, comfortable, realistic. There's a word I can't think of it. Natural, that's the one. Uh, sadly, with these you can't. But you can still extend them. And he's got a pretty good wingspan. Look at that. Yeah, head will go up and down. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good. I, I kind of wish this was the same colour as the body, but uh, so what? It is what it is. They're pretty cool. Uh, I've shown a um, Legends class figure as size comparison, so let's just bring out Legacy Wild Rider. If anyone's sick of me using Wild Rider and Drag Strip as size comparisons, feel free to go on Amazon. Send me a free... I'm... I'm you're welcome to, okay? I'm not saying you have to, I'm just, you know. Anyway. Should we transform them? Okay, good, okay. Right, so. They transform very similar, but they're a bit more sturdy now. For example, these knee pieces. These are my first original one. Uh, nearly fell off. But this comes out, rotates past, doesn't catch there, anything, no problem at all. What I should have done first was turn the foot around. I'm not smart. Bring it round... Big obvious notches that these things go into. It's out of place. Okay. Do this side. Rotate that around. 
Okay. Eh, this one wants to fight with me a little bit. Okay, come on. Come on. Just because you're on camera, you were fine before. Come out. Rotate around. And into place. Stand it up. Fold the tail most of the way up. It'll go a bit more flush later, but we won't worry about that now. Rotate the front legs on this purple armature back. Bring these back forward, rotate them out, turn down, turn down, fold down the panel, push, flip through, close, fold the tails up, and tie the arms, the robot, uh, animal legs on the back, however you see. Okay, fine, good. And there he is in robot mode. It's not rocket science, it's not difficult, it's not, you know, anything we haven't seen before. But it's awesome, and he's solid. And I like it. Let's do this one. Okay, stand back a minute. He's got some big wings. So, we're going to get these. And on that pin there, rotate it through. And that's the leg. Get there, rotate it through. And that's the leg. Get the headpiece, hold it down. And then, noise up, hang on. Push this through. And as this pushes through, it'll dislodge this piece from the back. So if you push... Come to there, then you can bring this all the way over, lock it into place, fold this up on the back, and that's the body and head. Uh, what you do is you have to wait for that so that this comes through, this is the uh, back of the neck piece where it meets the body, and then it leaves a nice little groove that that tail goes into. That's awesome. Rotate the shoulders to the front, which is what I forgot to do before, and then just bring the arms down. And there we go. Sadly, you can't straighten the arms. This is the one thing I wish they'd done, is just fix the arms. But it is what it is. And what it is looks really cool. Like, just the way the legs transform. You've got the knee with some detail and a cool foot. And then the beast, it's just got this big talon and it, it works. It really works. And I really like them. Really, really like them. They are awesome. Kind of wish they'd done like the blot of that series in the deluxe. That'd have been cool with good quality plastic, not a KO. Because that, I, I worry that thing would shatter. Okay, so let's bring him back in. Let's get dead end here. And yeah, it kind of looks like he's walked into the wrong bar, and they're going to beat him up and take his money. <laughs> they're awesome. They are. They're legitimately really cool figures, and I really like them. So thank you very much, Mike. And Michelle, Blushes and Doobitch, thank you very much. This, they are awesome. Genuinely good quality, solid figures. And you can't fault them. They're solid. They're lovely. So thank you. Thank you for that. I know it might just be a random, oh, I'll just throw them in. But no, they are awesome. So thank you. And uh, again, thank you for a uh, studio series called Class Ravage, who's still inside Sound Dave. There he is. He's cool. It's where he's going to stay 90% of the time, but at least he... This now feels like a complete figure, so... Anyway, I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to scarp it. So again, if you feel like donating to the channel, you can either do Patreon, PayPal, uh, Coffee, I think, is still a thing. I, I never check it, but it might be. And of course, you can go to Amazon and donate directly to me. No mess around, just send it straight to me. Don't give me money and me go, oh, I'll buy something you don't like. No, no, just send it straight through me, uh, straight to me, through Amazon. If you got Prime, it'll be there the next day. How cool is that? I'm going to go. Okay, so these guys are awesome, and I'm going to leave. Okay, thank you. So, I should be ugly, I should be righteous, and I shall see all of you in the next one. Toodles!